1985, we first started talking to the LTT, formally and structurally, and mediated by India, we had the talks with LTT in Thimpo, at the capital of Bhutan. Talks centered around on the evolution of power. But the LTT moved out of the talks. But the government of President Rajapaks, uh, President Jawadana, went ahead to implement the Indo Lanka Accord that introduced the proposals for devolution of power to the periphery from the center, the creation of the provincial councils in our country, which got into the constitution in terms of the 13th Amendment. We had this instrument well built into the constitution, unable to be implemented in the north and the east of Sri Lanka because of the resistance and the presence of the LTT seeking a separate state in Sri Lanka, advocating terrorism, extremism and wanting to be a fascist movement. The country was not ready in any manner to concede any extremist forces in our country, whether it is in the north or the south.